We are Susie and Rolls. That's short for Roland, by the way. Enchanté. Follow our lives renovating a 15th century chateau and citadel. Together with our rescue fur babies, Big Baxter, Mad Max and little Lexia Beaver. Bonjour! It's a lovely but chilly day here today at the Citadel. Uh, we've got lots to show you. Ten months ago when we moved in we said to the vendor do not feel obliged to remove anything and he obviously didn't feel obliged because he didn't remove anything. So the very first thing we did when we moved in on day one was to walk around the place with the camera to document everything as it had been left. So, without further ado, I shall hand you over to my glamorous assistant, Susie, who's been itching to show you all around. Okay. Welcome to our hallway, our grand stone spiral staircase. Uh, as you can see, we've been stripping bits of wallpaper off. It's a bit tempting as you go up the stairs. <laughs> because yeah. some of these actually plastered over the stonework. Yeah, because we suspect the wall is granite, don't yeah. we? So. And um, that we've got to pick off all this plaster. But this piece under the stairs has been blocked in at some point. And we did ask the previous owner, and he seemed to think there was all rubble behind there. But it's quite a big area that would go under the stairs there. So yeah. that's, we're going to get a camera if we can in there. And investigate. Because it does sound solid. That, that doesn't. It's probably been block, block worked, you know, breeze blocks, that sort of thing. Yeah. And then rubble behind, if there's rubble behind. Um, yeah, this is fine. But um, this has been repaired, unfortunately, with cement. Yeah, dark, isn't and it? Parts of stone have actually been painted over, and you can see this. This is solid plaster they've put on here. And this is our lovely front door. It's got a panel inside you can open to clean the window and let air in in the summer. So that looks out That's... towards our bread oven. Yeah, it's a nice doorway actually. It looks, um, might have got a little bit damp at some yeah. point in the bottom there, but I think it's okay. Uh, yeah, this has all got to come off. We, well, we're hoping it's all stone under there. Again, it's all been plastered. This is, as far as we know, the oldest part of the, the property. It yeah. um, maybe dates back as far as 1409. Yeah. So well worth getting it back to how it would have been when it was first built. And we were left this bit of tree trunk, weren't we? Because there is some more in the attic. I th yeah, there's another piece like that somewhere. Very interesting. Um, I, th I can only assume it was here as a, some sort of doorstop. <laughs> there's no other reason for it being here. Probably because they cut a tree down, but it's just really unusual. Yeah. Decorative. Well, we'll make that into something. I'm a woodworker, so that will get made into something. Mm. So we've got some double doors here. I think this is a new addition. It's not been finished off. So that's something we've got to do. I don't mind this yellow glass actually, because we're going to use parchment paint on the ceilings and stuff, which is a yellow in colour. Um, and the door, we've got really nice doors. This is a new addition. Their idea of the toilet in the cupboard. <laughs> which again hasn't been finished off no but so actually um this house didn't have any toilets in at all years ago you many to years go outside many years ago <laughs> uh we've been left a random shaving bowl, bowl on the wall here i don't know what the <laughs> idea of that is really but what a lovely feature yeah <laughs> really interesting <laughs> We were left this nice picture on the wall. It's quite a nice scene, actually. I don't know where it's from. 
Um, I think it needs a nicer frame, mm. like all the others. Um, we've got lots of funny bits of wiring everywhere. I don't know what that's for, a telephone. Well, that's for a telephone, so that, that can all be stripped out. And we've been left a lampshade, telephone table, a drop lid table, prayer chair. Prayer chair? Which I'm not going to... Oh, right. So, yeah, I see. Yeah, prayer this, chair. This is the electric cupboard. Oh, uh, bit of a horror story. Yeah. I don't know whether you'll be able to see I that. I don't know. I've seen worse. I'm not sure that's up to modern <laughs> standards. Don't know. <laughs> a few spiders in there. We are expecting to rewire this place, so it's not really a surprise to us. I like this telephone table, actually. Could do with recovering, perhaps. Yeah, mm. at some point. Yeah, at some point. Um, I think somebody had a love of horses here. They did have horses and donkeys, apparently. And I've seen another one laying around somewhere. So I think probably a family member painted it. Mm, it's quite nice. It's stuck in there. Mm. Yeah. And the obligatory crucifix. We've got a few of those around. You're never far away from a crucifix in France. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dodgy bit of um, wallpapering and the ceiling needs doing, plus the um, plaster's blown or whatever's on there. Yeah, I think it's the plaster blown. And we've got this light, it's brass, but it's all tarnished. But I've got a few chandeliers I want to put up anyway. I wonder how that will look actually uh, brought back to life. They say you shouldn't clean brass, you, you, you should keep the patina, but sometimes no. I think actually I'd just rather have I, the brass. Yeah, but I want a chandelier up there. Yeah. Crystal chandelier. So uh, we've got the original floor here, but it's a bit worse for wear in places. Mm. And we have got the hectagonal tiles on the landing which we might bring down and replace some of these and redo the landing. It's particularly I, bad I at this end. I do like this floor, but it's yeah. really bad there. It's bad at this end, isn't it? And we've got doors through to the garden. The dogs are out there again. Um, a nice heavy radiator again, which will be painted. Yeah, I love those. They're all going to be gold. Yeah. And a rug. I did have a look on the back of this. It's from 1978 so that's pretty old in itself and you'll see this floral pattern uh, when we go through to the grand salon it's not floral well, what is it then <laughs> it's, oh that i thought you meant i thought you were talking about this matching no these i thought that's yeah. what you were going to say these okay. here yeah yeah <laughs> okay yeah the rest of it's obviously not Okay. Right, that's our hallway. Great. So I've just come out the bar and I've got my weeding cushion out, but somebody else has decided to use it. <laughs> I'll have to go and get another one, it's off an old sofa. Yes, you. Something interesting here though, oh. this is the entrance to the big barn, I'm just scraping up all the weeds and it looks like it's all cobbles under here, the only problem is, if it is, I've got the whole great big driveway to do. Yeah, I wonder how far out they come out. I don't know, no. well, somebody else has come Max to... getting in on the act. Yeah, because I suppose being an entrance to the barn, they might have had some heavy equipment, so they might have needed to reinforce. Well, they did have ponies and Yeah. And things. We don't know how far out it extends, but uh, just to give you a bit of an insight, if it extends all this way... It's going to take me forever. Oh, that's your job, is it? <laughs> yeah, okay, well, we'll keep our eye on that. Be a bit of a trip hazard, but yeah, oh well, don't trip over then. <laughs> I think it's nicer than weeds. Oh well, we'll keep our eye on that. But anyway, it looks like you've lost your cushion today. No, I'll go and get another one. <laughs> so, just out 
of interest. Um, I just wanted to see what the base of this barn is, and it appears to be concrete. Um, it's hard. Uh, I'm not doing it all today, but I just wanted to add an interest. Um, because they would have used this probably for machinery in here. And, all, and as you can see, there's so much stuff in here. There's no way that I'm going to do this today. <laughs> I've got to find somewhere to put all the soil. So that's another find. So we looks like we've got a stone or concrete base in here. We've got this huge wood pile to use up. <laughs> Right, this is how far I've got. It's taken me ages. Um, but there is a gully here, which is why we've got a pond, because the water obviously all ran into it, so these rocks shouldn't be here. <coughs> so I've dug out the bit in the barn, but I'm just getting all these weeds out here for the moment. So that's all I can do right now. So I'm I've got my trusted tool here, a wallpaper scraper. As I said, we haven't got any of our garden tools here. I have got a weed tool there, which is quite handy. Yeah, we're having to make do. Yes, yeah, show them the rake. Ah, the rake. We were wanting a rake. And we haven't got one here, but miraculously, we found one. <laughs> yes, it's... um. Let me... Uh, if you grab that, Susie. <laughs> and it's got woodworm. And it's got woodworm, obviously. So there you go, a rake made from a branch. But we have a rake. We have rake capability. It might work. <laughs> <laughs> this is the master bedroom, bedroom three. And so but, we're using this, but we haven't put anything in yet, so you can get an idea of what's been left here. Obviously, that's our bed and cover. There's Baxter. <laughs> so, yeah, we've been left a nice bed. Um, and I can say that they're quite handy as far as bedside tables. There's a little chair there, and we'll put some nice silly ones. Um, I don't actually mind the wallpaper in this room, but it's. Two nice wall lights. And actually, the ceiling light's really nice. We're going to um, expose the beam here. We wondered if it was concrete, but it's not. It's hollow. So we're going to get all that up there. Yeah, let's have a look. Because this is... Uh, how big is this room? I can't remember. 36 square metres. 36 square metres. Yeah. Sofa or something. And Max, you haven't been in the shot top here. No. Yeah, good boy. So we've, we've got two <laughs> rugs here. Yeah. Which uh, find in a minute. Bit of a clean required. Peacock on. Um, I don't, I'm not quite sure what's going on here with these tassels. It's <laughs> behind. This is another I'm, fireplace. I'm not behind that. That's for another day. Mm. We don't know what's behind there. But this is another one of those sort of plainish. Yeah. It, I don't know when these were put in because we've got the nice big stone granite fireplaces going on downstairs yeah. and in bedroom uh, one. No, yeah. In bedroom three. And we've got this nice armor. I'll just step back so I can get it all in view. One of the problems with all their armoires over here is that they um, they don't hang clothes from them. No. It's all shelves. So I think they're not particularly nice drawers in there. No, but there you go. It's a lovely piece there. We've got a window over the rosemary garden again, and at some point somebody's plastered all this, which is coming off. But we're going to leave the brick, the stones exposed. Yeah, it's just like lovely. The lovely. Ground, so it's lovely granite, isn't it? Yeah. Just 
Mm-hmm. One of the things we've noticed on a lot of the windows, not all of them, I don't think we'll be able to pick it up on oh, the film, is there's um, these stickers, these stickers that, on the window. I haven't had a close look, I don't know what they are. Um, but they're on all of them. Well, well not all of them, but most of them. And we've got the nice big original radiator again here, because it's the same. And actually the pipe work is like a radiator in itself. Yeah, the pipe work's very and hot, isn't it? If you switch these off, they're basically hot. And of course the floor. Yeah, the floor's not bad. Not bad at all. And the dogs have got their own bed. <laughs> yeah, ours. <laughs> no, this one, the sleigh bed. Little sleigh bed, which... Um, Baxter seems to have um, commandeered. Yeah, commandeered. <laughs> and so cute. again, we've got another beam now. Um, and the lovely corbels. Which we'll, we'll expose. Yeah. And we've got another window over here, which looks out onto the courtyard, which is the front of the house, I think. And as you can see, this. We've past is even worse. Yeah, we've been. <coughs> oh, Lexi, we've been peeling that off by hand, which shows just how easy it is. And of yeah. course, what's under that plywood as well, mm. we don't know. But uh, do you want to open the window? We'll have a quick view yeah. over the meadow. So that's our gate. So this is basically the front of the house. Um, just quickly show you. And that's our meadow. Yeah, the cows are in the other field today. The sun's out, so it might go a bit funny. This. And there's our bread oven, which we'll show you in a, a later video, perhaps. And there's the outbuildings, which again we've got to explore. And that's the tower. But we'll go through all that in another video. It's a lovely day. Mm. Mm. And that's about it, I think. Yeah, I think that's about it for this room. So that's the master bedroom. Chanté.